exercises. So the first one you see on the list, they're called donkey kicks. So whether you're at home or at the gym, you're gonna want a bench um, or chair. So the whole point of this movement, basically you're trying to do butt kicks, going side to side, so picture a donkey, you know, kicking somebody. So you're just going right here, kick, side to side. Fast you can each you know count each kick is one rep. Um, again, if you're at the the gym or if you have a, a bench press um, bench at home, I recommend that to make it a little more challenging so you have to actually clear and jump over the bench. Um, again, if you have any challenges with with jumps, especially butt kicks, just go side to side. Maybe you know work on your range of motion if you can't quite kick your butt. Just go as fast as you can side to side, up as high as you can, you know, over the month. Eventually, you know, try to get to where you're doing actual butt kicks. The next exercise on the list, everybody that just did March Madness, should be pro at the push-up. So you're just going to be right here, you got the regular push-up. Especially with push-ups, I want you to focus on good form and technique. I know, again, the minute challenge, you're trying to knock out as many reps as you can. Don't sacrifice form for reps. Make sure you're doing quality over quantity. But as time goes on, obviously, you know, you'll master the, the technique and you know, get, get more reps. So make sure you're doing everything right. So you got the regular push-ups, and if you can't do those, you know, just do the push-ups from your knees. And if you're super fit, crazy guy, woman, you know, if you have any resistance bands or a plate, a weighted plate, put those on your back. You know, some of you guys wear the vest. Do whatever you want to add resistance to challenge, you know, whatever fitness level again you're at. Um, just go as hard as you can. Um, if it's too easy, I want you to, to make sure you're challenging yourself. Last exercise for Wednesday, jumping jacks. So with these, I want you focusing on good form again. A lot of people don't go through the full range of motion. I want straight arms, hands touching the top. And then if, you're, if you have any shoulder issues, mobility problems, just uh, keep your hands right here and just go count those. That's fine. Again, this is a challenge. That can be modified for you. Um, I want you to participate. So if you have to, you know, if you if you have any kind of injuries, things you need to work around, let me know. But jumping jacks, pretty clear. And while you're doing them, to get some core work. Embrace that core again. Push that belly towards your spine and just breathe out like I was, and just go as fast as you can. <laughs> 